We are back after a little technical difficulty. Susanna doesn't know how to operate technology. So anywho, here we are back with Gulia Yelps. And we are going to bestow her little spirit items on her. Let me fix her little glasses first because um, they're down around her jawline. She can't see. There we go. So, Goya has the spirit finger and the spirit flag. Woo -woo. So, let me see. Now, you know your Nana cannot get these girls to hold the things they're supposed to hold. So, I have the worst trouble with that. Um, so, let me see if I can get Miss Gulia to hold the things she's supposed to hold in the way she's supposed to hold them. So, we'll start with the foam finger. Here we go. Oh, if we could just squeeze that little pinky in there, I think it'll fit. Oh, I did it! Yay! Oh, you know what? Silly Nana. That's in the wrong hand. <laughs> oh, here we go again. One more try. The three fingers and the thumb. up like that. That makes more sense, right? We're number one. <laughs> These dolls are so bendy. It's hard to get them to do exactly what you want them to do. Because they are so bendy. Okay. How's that look? Yeah, that looks pretty good. Let's see if we can get the flag in her other hand. Let's see. Well, the emblem actually needs to be on the other side, doesn't it? But that's okay. We'll just smush her little fingers here together. There you go, Miss Goya Yelps and her spirit flag and finger and her white earrings, red glasses, an outfit fully intact. Oh no, you know what? She needs one more thing. She needs her silver belt. She comes with a silver belt that's supposed to go over these shorts. So that is the last thing we need to find for Miss Goya. And she will be 100% complete. All we'll need to do is give her a spa day and fix her curly hair. All right, Miss Goya Yelps. Now let's get our Werecat Trio and give them their megaphones. Three. So, we have Miss Dorlai Stripe, Meow. Miss Meow Liddy, and Persephone, who Nana incorrectly named as Meow Liddy before I knew better. Now, Persephone's stand is not here yet because we gave it to Miss Claudine Wolf. So she's going to sit, 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 sit. Here we go. And the other two are going to stand, although Miss Meality is having some trouble standing right now. Oh, Nana pulled her hair. Whoopsie. Okay, so if I remember right, 
I know that Torlai Stripe was released with the pink megaphone. So we will put that in her hand. Okay. Mm, let's bend her arm up just a little bit. Man, these megaphones are heavy, so. I don't think that they can hold them up. I think that you just have to hold them up to their mouths when they're yelling, like doing a cheer. But otherwise, they kind of have to hold them down because they are pretty heavy. Let's bring that camera up just a bit if I can do that without turning you off again. Okay. Now, next up is Miss Meowlady. And her hair is white, so we're going to give her the black megaphone. And we'll put that in the sand. That little pinky finger doesn't want to behave. Behave, little pinky finger. There we go. Okay, so Miss Meowlady has her black megaphone. And last up, oh, she fell over, <laughs> is Persephone. And since Persephone has a white stripe in her hair, we will give her the white megaphone. So let's put that in her hand. It's a good thing they have rubber fingers because Nana probably would have broke them all by now. There we go. All right. So she's got her white megaphone. And there you have it. The Werecat Trio with their accessories. Now, I think that we should give... Okay, so this pom-pom actually belongs to Draculaura, but you girls were playing with it, so you kind of, you know, gave it to somebody else, and that's fine. But we're going to give this back to Draculaura, and then I think that we should give Claudine, Claudine Wolf, the duffel bag, because she doesn't have anything to carry yet. So let me put the wear cat trio back on the shelf and i will bring down claudine and dracula one two and three and now if miss claudine Miss Draculaura could please step forward. You will be the next on the stage. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun. Draculaura and Miss oh, Claudine Wolf. And she just kicked her friend in the head. Did you see that? I saw that. Let's bring that up just a little bit. Now, Dracula has our extra accessory, her bright pink purse on right now, because she's obviously running to catch the bus because she was late. So, we're just going to take her purse off, and we will leave her in this adorable little pose that you girls stood her in. And we will give her this pom-pom because I think that would just look too cute. Now, you know Nana and this pom-pom. We have some bad history. Mm-hmm. So, we're going to see if we can get this to stay. But Nana's going to buy this little hook that will help us get these accessories on their hands. Like they're supposed to be. So, hey, I did it. Rah, rah, sis, boom, bah. All right, 
So there's Draculaura. And then let's bring up Claudine. And on Miss Claudine, we will bestow the coveted Monster High Duffel Bag. Woohoo! We'll just hang that right on her shoulder. Maybe. <laughs> and she is ready to go to competition. When do we get on the bus, girls? Right now. Okay. One, two, three, let's go. Oh, you better hurry, Dracula. We're going to be late. So here you have it, our Monster High Fear Team with more of their accessories. We're getting awful close, girls. We're just about there. So these three wear cap or trio, they have their megaphones. Frankie, she still needs her spirit team megaphone, so that's one. Draculara needs her other pom-pom, so that's two. Uh, Guya needs her silver belt, so that's three. And then Claudine needs whatever you girls want her to have, so that's four. So we probably have four more items to order or try to accumulate. And then I thought we should get one of the boys in here. So Deuce, I think his name is Deuce Gorgon. He's the uh, crush of Miss Cleo Denial, but he's one of the original boys in the series. I think we should try to get him or the guy whose hair like catches on fire all the time. Can't remember his name, but I'm sure you girls know it. So join me tomorrow for the next episode of the Monster High Unboxing Fear Leading Team. See you tomorrow.